Hey guys, I am DC creator and host of Barside Jive. And I bet you're wondering why I say that every time. <laughs> the reason I do is because I never know when someone new, a newbie may hop on and watch and they don't know. So I gotta say it. So you old timers <laughs> that hang with me every freaking day, just gonna have to get used to it. Just, you're gonna have to just get past if you can. <laughs> I know you know that I am DC creator and host of Our Side Job, but they may not. Guys, I do want to welcome all of you, even you old schoolers, <laughs> to my daily dose of rock music history. It's going to be a blast, so just strap in. Today is Tuesday, November 12th, 2019, and you are witnessing my Carnival of Love Tour, day 33. And guys, if you hadn't bought your uh, your DC's gear your, your, from my merch table, uh, it's Carnival of Love Tour right now on the back of those tees and those hoodies. But once this tour is over, which it's almost like, almost half over, okay? Um, you won't be able to get it anymore because it won't be available because we're going on to a different tour and those shirts won't be available. Just telling you, $25 for tees and $50 for hoodies and I'll tell you where you can get them in just a minute. Anyway, guys, I am coming at you live worldwide and studio side. Did I tell you it was my Carnival of Love Tour Day 33? <laughs> Oh, I'm sure I did. That was before my commercial, I guess. Okay, so let's talk some rock and roll. Flashback. On this day, 1966, this is going to be cool. This is going to be cool today. So I hope you're like turned on, tuned in. This is cool. On this day, 1966, the Levi Strauss Company began selling bell freaking bottom blue jeans in the U.S. of A. That's right, guys. Bell bottom blue jeans. On this day. Don't you wish you still had yours? Yeah, I bet you do. You know what? If you had them, don't you wish you could still fit into them? <laughs> oh, I'm not laughing at you. Anyway, bell bottom, those were cool. Still love them. Paul McCartney married photographer Linda Eastman in a small civil ceremony at the Marabone Registry Office in the city of Westminster in central London on this day in 1969. What a great year. Contrary to the popular rumor of the day, she was not related to the Eastmans of Eastman Kodak fame. But she was a photographer. And she probably used Kodak film. Probably. I mean, Kodak was probably all that was available. But anyway, yeah, she wasn't related. Now, Paul's brother Mike served as the best man, but none of the other Beatles were in attendance. Can you believe that? None of the other guys. No Ringo, no George, no John. Probably not even Pete Best. But Mike was there because that was his bro. I mean, his real bro. And unfortunately, Linda would die of cancer on April 17th, 1998 at the age of 56. What a young age. But uh, awesome couple. That's tough. Okay, guys, John Lennon and Harry Nielsen are thrown out of the Troubadour nightclub in LA, that would be Los Angeles, not Louisiana, for heckling the Smothers Brothers on this day in 1974. Nielsen, a good friend of Tom Smothers, one of the two Smothers Brothers, thought he was helping the act because Tom had struggled through weak material at an earlier day. Yeah, right, right. They were freaking high. That was the deal. They were freaking high. It doesn't, we don't know that for sure, but I guarantee you that was the deal. Because I'm telling you, when you put John Lennon and Harry Nielsen together, 
they were doing drugs, guys. <laughs> That's just the bottom line. Anyway, next up, the Sex Pistols. The Sex Pistols were involved in a fight at London's Speakeasy Club, resulting in one of the show's engineers needing 14 stitches in his head on this day in 1977. How about this? In a poll conducted, yeah, a poll conducted on this day in 01, that'd be 2001, by the Recording Industry Association of America, music fans voted Judy Garland's Over the Rainbow. Over the Rainbow. Over the Rainbow. As the song of the century. The Rolling Stones' Satisfaction came in at number 16, and The Beatles' I Want to Hold Your Hand was number 26. And that was in 2001, guys. I wouldn't have voted for Over the Rainbow as the song of the century then. Maybe when I was younger. I loved that movie, though. The Wizard of Oz. I was so disappointed when that dude, the professor dude, I found out he was like a real dude behind the curtain. Yeah. Anyway, anyway, that's pretty interesting. I mean, yeah, beat out like satisfaction. Yeah, and I want to hold your hand. Wow. So go Judy Garland. On this day in 2004, Rosalind Morganfield, the 34-year-old daughter of blues artist Muddy Waters, surrendered to police after a warrant was issued accusing her of being involved in the 1996 murder of 19-year-old Timothy Jason Harrington during a drug deal. Wow. Well... One more, guys. Bob Dylan. Bob mingled unnoticed among 14 other tourists at John Lennon's childhood home in Liverpool on this day in 2009. Yet no one recognized old Bob. The folk legend strolled around the place where the late former Beatle grew up with his Aunt Mimi and Uncle George and later said that he was enthralled, enthralled to see the bedroom where Lennon wrote some of his earliest songs. Enthralled. Well, DC was enthralled when I got to see Lennon's home uh, back in 2008, I believe I was there in Liverpool, 2008. Yeah, I think so, 2000, yeah. 2007, 2008-ish. I was there and I believe his, yeah. Yeah, because uh, we got to go around and see all their um, homes where they grew up. And uh, I saw it too, and I was totally enthralled. Guys, it's that part of the show where, like, I have to tell you that uh, I know, I know. <laughs> Try to hold back the tears. No crying. So, no crying zone. But my raucousry lesson is like over, 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 finished, done. Yeah. So if you were crying, just dry those eyes because there's more coming from me to you tomorrow and every day. In fact, I've got a show tonight in just a little bit. Yeah, 7.30 p.m. Central Standard Time here at the Vocal Studios. And I want to talk more rock history. But I do this like every day regularly and you can watch me as I peel back those pages I mean peel back those pages of my rock history book exploring the past of rock legends on my daily dose of rock music if you guys would like to check out my daily dose archives just go to my YouTube channel youtube.com forward slash high speed far side jive live and look in the daily dose playlist for mo and hey, while you're there, would you show me some love and just click that big ass red subscribe button? It's big, it's red, it says subscribe on it, and it's free. It's free. 
Tell your friends. Tell your family. It's free. Also, I cover rock news and history during my weekly live Tuesday and Thursday shows, just like I will tonight, at the Vocal Media Studios in North Dallas. Very cool place. Both those 60-minute shows are packed full of music, including nationally touring singer-songwriters, as well as some of the very best tribute and cover bands in the entire country during my live music showcase. That's right, DC's live music showcase. And then, of course, my tipsy gypsy bring acres. She brings drinks and tips from behind the bar when she's not flat fighting a flood from a broken pipe. <laughs> as well as my Art Jive Live segment, my visual arts segment featuring legendary artist Brad Jensen when he's not nursing a bad cold or the flu, as well as other creatives. So join us at VocalNow.com. And as always, Vocal spelled with a K. That's right, Boner, with a K. And we don't know why it's spelled with a K. Because vocals actually spelled with a C, but our vocals spelled with a K. Maybe someone was just high when they spelled it. <laughs> but anyway, we're living with it, baby. So go to vocalnow.com. Look for the bar side jive image. It's at the top of the screen, top of your browser, top of the app, next to the zoo. Go right there and click on it. Come right in the show. We'll beam you right up. Beam you right in. Besides my live show, yeah, in the Dallas Design District at 1523 Dragon Street every Wednesday at 7 p.m., sponsored by Optographics, Hip and Hippie, and Edo Popkin, I've got my new show. This will be the third one at the new location of Sloan and Williams Winery, Outlaw Cider Company, every Friday, 6 to 7 p.m. So come see me, Louisville and surrounding area. Or you can just watch us on Facebook Live. If you're lazy, come down and see me. Get you some wine. Get you some cider. Get you some live music. It's a good time every Friday evening. And we've got like 48 of those freaking heaters. So it's like really warm. Guys, if you want to support the show, it's real easy. You got a buck? Okay. Go to paypal.me, P-A-Y-P-A-L.me forward slash slow mo. Bar Side Jive Live and contribute. Donate to our gear fund. Yep. We'll put it to good use. Promise. Guys, I do appreciate your loves, likes, shares, and comments. Love those comments. Love to know what you're thinking. Those are what make all this worthwhile. Oh, don't forget to check out my Facebook page. Facebook.com forward slash Bar Side Jive Live. My Instagram at Bar Side Jive. My website, barsidejive.com. And last but not least, my YouTube channel where everything is archived. And that would be youtube.com forward slash barsidejive live. Guys, tonight in the house, Studio One, I've got Infinite Journey. Yeah, Infinite Journey, Dallas Fort Worth's premier journey tribute. Absolutely, they are. It's going to be a good show, guys. Oh, and i got a great show coming up tomorrow night in the Design District. I'll go ahead and tell you it's Little Pillars. Little Pillars is going to be there. And then on Thursday, Scary Cherry and the Bang Bangs. Oh, man. And it gets just keeps just getting better because i got a great show coming up on Friday at Sloan and Williams Winery. Hey, guys, i got to run. Thanks for hanging out with me during my Daily Dose today. And always remember to drink responsibly and don't drink or text and drive. No, 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 no. Don't want to do it. But I do want you to seek every day to be a hero in someone's life. And I will see you guys very, very soon, like tonight. Check us out, vocalnow.com with a K. 7.30 p.m., click Barside Jive. You'll see the image. It's like the one right behind me. Come right in the show. Enjoy. All right, guys. Peace, love, rock and roll. Good night, people. I'm thinking of you, too. I'm thinking of you. Is you ready, Ski Cat?
Watch up, Doc. Here's Johnny. Have mercy. you guys did experience some head, neck, or back tingles during this show and have an overwhelming sense of a deep, relaxing feeling, be advised that my content now does contain ASMR. This isn't just a word from the sponsor. It's simply a very good suggestion. It stands for Real Refreshment. Sidejivelive.com You are feeling the tingles. This is the best time to put the lotion. <laughs> 